Okay, folks, here we've got a brand new in the crate B2782B front mount Kubota snowblower. It fits your B series tractors. Um, I have one on my B3000, but it it's a little wore out right now, so uh, we're going to step up to a nice, shiny, brand new one. So come along with me and we'll uncrate this thing and put it together and see how it works. Okay, here it is. It's a much better look at it now. Nice 63 inch snowblower. There's a box of goodies. Let's open that up and see what's in there. What could be all oh, the instructions? Who needs that? Parts list. Parts for the chute. All right. Okay. Well, let's start putting her together. To see what we end up with. So here's the old one. It's a B twenty seven eighty two A. I'm not really sure what's so different about it that makes an A a B, but um, I guess we'll figure that out as we get into it. I do notice the B over there has got that nice little lifting hook on it that uh, this one doesn't have. So anyway, what we have to do with this, I have to take the hydraulic chute rotator off and the electric uh, deflector kit off and transfer those to the new one. Then we'll put this one all back to manual mode and get it for sale as soon as possible. See if we can recuperate some of the cost. It still works pretty good, just doesn't work as good as a new one. Anyway, that's it for now. Okay, so I swapped the chute over from, or excuse me, the chute rotator over from the old one. You know, it's a little hydraulic motor. It just bolts right on, the little spur gear there. The, I've also attached the chute. It's got to make sure that it's nice and free, perfect. That's good. It'll loosen up a bit. The one on the other one I always thought was too wobbly anyway. Okay, so here I've got my, my homemade shoot deflector installed. Kubota makes a nice one, but it's like $800 plus tax and... I got this linear actuator at Princess Auto for 80 bucks. Yes, I had to drill a bunch of holes in my brand new snowblower, but what are you going to do? So anyway, that's all ready to go. We're just about ready, I guess, to put her on the machine and give it a try. Um, I also took out this little grate that goes in here. All it seems to ever do is promote clogging, so it's gone. Uh, last thing I have to do is check the oil. There's the, there's the level plug right there. I'll double check if there's oil in it. And then I guess we can uh, put it on and give it a try. Uh, well, of course, first I'm gonna have to get this one out of here, but I'll need the quick hitch for that too. Okay, there it is. Mounted on, uh, mounted on my B3000.
Here's Old Faithful, my B3030. I bought it brand new. I still love it to bits, but it was getting a little cold sitting on top of that thing blowing snow, I'll tell you that. And this baby came along. Alrighty, ciao for now.